I'm Janet Biggs and I'm an artist from New York. I've been working on an exhibition um, that's here now at the Blaffer Museum for the last probably about three years. Um, the exhibition really stems from personal memories of uh, family members of mine that have uh, struggled with Alzheimer's and, and what that looks like from from my perspective and then a kind of projection of what that might possibly feel like from, uh, from their perspective. Um, the exhibition itself is a series of videos and some of them are uh, installations, which is what's behind me, a two-channel installation, meaning two different screens. Um, there's a very large installation with four screens, a four-channel, and then a single-channel or single-screen video. I actually like to call it an exploration. Um, about things like loss, memory loss, um, how we define a sense of self, how you maintain that sense of self, um, especially in the face of extreme situations, be they environmental or be they something like a diagnosis um, as severe as Alzheimer's. I was um, happily able to work with the University of Houston. They opened their doors and I worked with all sorts of faculty members uh, from the neurosciences through to pharmacology, to the geosciences, um, and while I would love to think of it as collaborative, um, I really felt like I was the one gaining all the information. Uh, but it did, I, I think that intersection between art and science is fascinating. Um, and, and one of the things that I've learned from it is that uh, both our, our methodology is similar in that um, if we both do our jobs well, it leads us to the next question. You know, not to the answer, but to the next question. I kind of ride the line of documentary filmmaking very closely, um, but because I define myself as an artist, not as a documentary filmmaker, there comes a point when I need to purposefully push myself sideways off of that path. And for me, often that comes by bringing in other images that make sense in my brain. Um, and hopefully that kind of leap will, will be compelling to um, someone else. You know, I, I don't even need my audience to know the per my personal connection to Alzheimer's. What I need what I hope that they will do is come and find some kind of emotional connection. I, I think the best artwork is intriguing enough that you want to learn more. But for me, you know, I want to be stimulated intellectually, so I want that. I, want, I would love my audience to have that experience. Um, but if it doesn't hit me emotionally, you know, life is too short. I don't have time for it. Um, so, so I want, I very much want to make work that can exist on many different levels and invite an audience member to say enter on one level and hopefully will encourage them to you know, have their own sort of exploration or search.